Hi, I'm Dr. Margaret, host of The Love Life with Dr. Margaret, and this is Moments with Margaret. Moments with Margaret is a place where I just want to sort of share a little bit about what I took away from each episode and maybe just ask you a question or two. Um, it's a personal way for me to interact with you and also to just share like the things that I'm learning, the things that I'm sitting with from each of our episodes. And so this is the first Moments with Margaret, and I'm discussing a little bit about one of my takeaways from my episode with Pamela Thompson. <sighs> Pamela dropped so many gems on that episode. Um, everyone that I've talked to that watched it said that they you know, had a notebook and they took notes and they walked away with so much um, so much of, of what she said, and so did I. Um, being in the moment with Pamela was really special. And also it was just tough to kind of be attentive to everything she was saying because it was an interview. And so I've watched it about three times um, since we released it. And I, each time, you know, something different sits with me. But there's one thing in particular that Pamela said um, that has just kind of been with me for a while now. And that is, um, Pamela mentioned that she pursues people, that she goes after them. And so I started thinking about, you know, that in the context of the conversation about love. And what I realized is that it's the love that's within Pamela that allows her to pursue people. So in essence, love pursues. And y'all, I've just been sitting with that thing, um, really just not not just in the context of like you know romantic pursuit again because the love life is expanding our understanding of love it's not excluding romance but it's just saying that love is bigger than that right so a lot of times we hear you know well if 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 you want someone you'll pursue them you'll go after them but i'm thinking about like how love does that in our lives love pursues us Love within us pursues other people, pursues our passions, pursues the things that bring us joy and fulfillment. And so I've just been sitting with the question, what is love pursuing in my life? How am I pursuing from a heart of love? What am I going after? Am I going after the things that are compelling me, are pulling me in? You know, am I going after what I want? Am I going after what I love? What is love pursuing in my life? And so in this moment with Margaret, I ask you the question, what is love pursuing in your life? How is love pursuing you? And how are you pursuing love? And how is love pursuing your passion, your purpose, the things that you want in your life? Even in this moment, that seems really hard and it just feels like, why do I need to go after anything at all? Um, you know, to pursue is not always to chase, you know, sometimes to pursue is to visualize, is to reflect, is to imagine, is to envision. Pursue is to think about what you want and, and see it actually happening in your life. So how are you pursuing? What is love pursuing in your life? If you haven't seen the episode with Pam, um, I just encourage you to watch it. It's it's a beautiful conversation. So many gems she dropped. Um, and I look forward to seeing you for episode two of The Love Life. If you could, please do me a favor. Watch the episode, comment. We'd love to hear from you. And also subscribe. Thank you so much. Um, I look forward to seeing you again on our next Moments with Margaret.